Cubo Squad is here back with another video. Today we are in a 2021 Cadillac XT4. This is a courtesy car from Home and Cadillac in New Jersey. Um, we borrowed it because my mom's car is currently in the shop. So I'm going to show you the key. We got the key right here. It's a super nice key. You got your trunk tailgate button. The back of the key. So now we're just going to put the key down in there. Lots of storage. Got storage in here. Got it all down there. It opens. I just don't know how right now. I will get that open for you. You got your dash So here. We're going to get a startup on it. I'll show you guys right here. There we go. Nice up. This is the dashboard. Get that music off. Uh, the steering wheel is really nice. It's sporty looking. This is the sport model. We got a bunch of carbon fiber going on on the interior. Orange stitching. Here's all your buttons. Uh, yes. The center console, it's got all your AC functions, everything you need, heated seats, heating steering wheel, everything you could want in a car. Now this is a great car to get started in the Cadillac family of SUVs. It's nice interior, I'll give you guys a little walk around and we'll get to that later, how super easy it is to get a car in. There's the back. More carbon, bunch of carbon up here. And I'll get into the screen, all the features on the screen. So it's got a Wi-Fi hotspot. You can get your users, apps, Apple CarPlay, Android Auto, audio. It's got Wi-Fi hotspot. Um, what else? You got climate. You got the My Cadillac, Sirius XM. You could go to climate and you can change the climate from here. Or you could just do it down there, like going to 70. Lower it. I could turn up my fan. Like that. Uh, we'll turn it off now. So we're just going to... And then you push it down. We'll put it back on 68. So yeah, you could also control it from up here too. You could like hit this button to raise the fans. Lower. Um, all of that features. You could also raise it. Then put it on. Like all that. Then there we go. You got all this. And it shows you what channel you're on, all that. And then, yeah, so this is the interior. The steering wheel is nice and sporty. Here's the um, uh, shifter. It's got all the buttons. It's got the dial. Um, you got um, your mode. Uh, what is that? Uh, auto start, I think. Traction control. And yeah, so this is the key. It's also got storage down there. Got it all. And there's a really cool feature. So I'm going to hit a button on the seat right here. Right there. See this button? You can hit it. And then a chair comes up and you can pick what you want. So, and it adjusts. So if I want it to go back, I can make it go up. Down to the side. And then there's also another one, like, and it shows you what you're doing. And then this one just brings those two blue parts in. It's so like, I'm pushing them out, and now I'm bringing them in. I'll show it to you guys in a second when I get out of the car. So now we're going to turn off the car. I'll show you that sequence. There you go. It tells you where you're heading. Car goes off when you up the... You lose the sun when you open the door. And yeah, so it's the interior. We'll go to the back now. There's your pedals down there. And then right here, it's got the trunk button. We'll open up the trunk. And yeah, so here's the front seat. Super nice. We'll grab the key. The door shuts really nicely. I'll show that to you guys. Now I'll show you the back. So come into the rear. It's got more carbon. More carbon. I know, it's sick. <laughs> but then you can shut your door. It's got carbon down there. The window. Heated seats in the back. Plugs. And fans. 
storage down there, more storage over there. And as you can see, I do have a baby sister. She does use a car seat. And it's actually super irrelevant for the anchors right here. You just put it in there and all, the anchors are down there. So it's super easy. No pulling the thing down, sticking it in like that. It's all hidden. And yeah, it's got a, a cup holder. It's not going down because of the car seat. We just have it. It could be a little over more. Here, I'll show you guys that. There's the cup holder. Nice and neat. And then I'll just have to... But yeah, so there's the passenger side. Rear. And then this is the front view. Forgot up there. It also has this where you could put sunglasses in and all. And there's the front. So yeah, now we're going to get to the back of the car. And we are going to go back there. So uh, yeah, let's go. Let's open the door, hop out. It's got the super nice clothes. We're gonna open the trunk here now. So you hit the key two times and here we go. And then this part right here opens with it. It's got a lot of storage. As you can see, you can put stuff over here, over there. Then you can open this. That's where your spare tire would be. So and then you close that up. And yes, yeah, so now we'll close it. You could close it from the key or you could close it up here. There's a button. And then it closes just like that. And like I said, this is a courtesy loaner from Home and Cadillac from Mount Laurel, New Jersey. And now we're just gonna do a walk around to the outside. As you can see, nice Cadillac logo. Got the wheel, the rims with some red calipers. The front of the car. Got the headlights. The black grill, cause it's a sporty model. It's the sport version. Red calipers up there. And yeah, so now we're gonna lock it. I'll show you the front lights. The horn is pretty loud if I don't if I say so myself. And you can come over here. Here's the back locking lights. Unlock. Yeah, and then we'll lock it again. On the side of the car. Unlock. Lock. You could also unlock it from right here. And it's locked now. It's got Wi-Fi, like I said, OnStar. And yeah, so that's the car. And we're gonna get one more start up from the back. And All right guys, so now we're gonna get a start up on the car and some revs. So here we go, start up. All right, now we're gonna get some revs. Pretty decent. Yeah, it's really nice, so there you go. It's also got mode, so you hit this mode button right here you hit the mode button right here and then you can put it up up there and it'll it has sport mode snow and ice mode and tour mode and then to leave it you just click it you leave it be and then and to put it in park all you do is hit this button right here and then it locks and now it's in park